If I were skinny, would you date me? I date you right now. Really? Yeah. Don't let these females gas you up, man. Don't let them gas you up. That's nice. It's a warm moment, warm your heart, but I, I don't know. She might be telling the truth. But people could just say anything and not mean it. Maybe she's just saying it for the camera. Who knows? Just to come off as a good girl. This sounds for everyone who looks younger than their actual age, and people don't believe them when you tell them how old you are. All right, before it pop up, Type it down below. How old do you think she is? Mm, actually, she look older than that. I'm not trying to roast. But I was thinking like 38 or something. I'm not trying to roast. Ladies, please stop getting tattoos all over your body. It's trashy. A diamond in the middle of your chest. It's just... Ah. All right, you want to know the true What's secret the to getting plan? a man? This is what you got to do. You got to sit down. You got to evaluate all your flaws. Mm. You need to work on them. Okay. So you can become the woman that okay. you need to be to attract the man that you want to have. Period. Mm. There you go. Well, do you cook? No. She probably ain't looking for a relationship right now. She having fun. She doing her. So she haven't done that yet. But it's good advice. This is what happens when your boyfriend gives you a bracelet and dumps you to be with your best friend. Have fun with her, Ryan. I don't think Ryan will ever recover. I mean, this looks like an old video, and I bet he still can't sleep to this day. To this day! When he hates me now, but I'm proof he can get pretty girls. Oh, come on with the ego. I'm sure there's plenty of people who don't think you're that pretty. And are those lips fake? Look, that's a turnoff, ladies. I don't know if it's injections or what. if y'all shoot something in them or... Some other type of weird procedure or something that just suck your lips in and swell them up before you leave out the house. I don't know, but men don't find it attractive. I don't know if you guys care or if you ladies care, but men don't find it attractive. Or the broom eyelashes. But hey, maybe you're doing it for yourself, so I'll shut up. I'm not your enemy. I'm your hero. You know, share up. She's still in love with him. When women care enough, to make a TikTok about you, whether it's positive or negative, she's still madly in love with you. Because if she was over you, well, she'd be making a TikTok about somebody else. So I just went on a cruise and my ex was just thinking about me and wanted to let me know. So here's some things that he was posting about me. Of course, I had to reply. Because if we're going to talk about it, let's make sure that we're correct. Of course, we have to take it to Instagram in case... This is petty. They're both trash. Look, keep your relationship off social media. If you don't trust a person, just don't be with them. But it just creates problems, potential problems. You in the comment section, who who posted a smiley face under this post? I mean, it's all stupid. It's immature. It's petty. It's, it's just it's not worth it. How much money have you wasted on liquor today? Zero dollars? Bitch, I get all my drinks paid for. Why? Look at me. Basic A. F. But well, see, in America, the criteria or standards to consider yourself a bad B is pretty basic. Bare minimum. The bar is in H-E double hockey sticks. All you got to do is be skinny, take a bath, and have long hair. And actually, you don't even got to be skinny. I'll keep the long hair one. You, know, you don't really got to take a bath. So, ladies, don't get... A big ego because you get drinks bought for you at a bar. Guys are just desperate. It's not that you're a baddie. No offense. I'm all for feminism. I'm all for all the shit it brings. Equal pay, chicks become president, all that shit. But now you got to give men their shit back. Let us be men again. You don't respect us. It's in subtle ways. I found out recently my girlfriend has no respect for me in a casual conversation. We were talking with some buddies about UFC. We were talking about how a lot of those guys get arrested. They get in trouble for domestic violence. They beat their girlfriends and wives. And my girlfriend says to a bunch of other dudes, she goes, oh, yeah, that's why I would never want to date somebody like that. The kind of guy, like, if he just lost control, could, like, kick the shit out of you. And I was like, I could beat the shit out of you. Okay, the lesson that could be learned from this, ladies, don't try to fight men. You can't beat men. You can't beat 95% of men in the fight. I don't know how we got to this point where women are running up on men, poking them in the head, punching them, really thinking they can 
really run a fair one with a man. Just, just don't. It could end very, very bad. I'm saying this out of love. 